was Friday night um, in my little cafe that I come to. It's my, like, part of my territory now. Uh, this is my favorite one, so this is where I come. It's got a lot of like, um, just nice stuff around it, nice fine shops, a supermarket. There's a place I can recharge, um, get top ups on my phone and stuff, so I come here. And uh, yeah, it's Friday. So it's a bit of a review of the week, a review of the month. I've been in this city for one month now. Um, and it's been crazy. It's been a crazy month. Um, I would say the highlights would definitely be the second week of hardcore supermarket cold approach. That was definitely a highlight. Uh, Renaissance week, man. Difficult week, in a sense, energetically, like a very fatiguing week. Um, but still, still pretty solid. Um, <laughs> Beyond that, you know, notable events would be having a bird's nest uh, in my room. Like, well, finding it after like two and a half weeks of staying here, realizing that noise in my room, it's actually a bird's nest, live birds. Uh, so that was an interesting one. Dealing with my landlady again, interesting. Uh, and yeah, deciding actually, a couple of things is first of all your apartment is so important to your day-to-day -day life and a lot of apartments that look good on photos on Airbnb turns out they're very poorly thought out and it's a gamble every time so you don't really know what's gonna happen until you get there so I decided to move on moving to a different place a different part of the city which is quite low cost so even if it doesn't work out I don't really care I'll probably just leave after a week if it doesn't work out um, but I don't think it, I think it will actually be good um, from what I've seen. Um, and then also, yeah, just just kind of like settling into this new place for a week, um, for this first month. Uh, first thing I would say is, well, with all the cold approach I've been doing, I've realised like it's, it should be fairly obvious, but um, I realised that you know there are characteristics that I of a city that make it more amenable to that and there are characteristics that make it less amenable and having essentially no pedestrian areas no large pedestrian areas where there's a footfall of traffic is a major disadvantage it's a major disadvantage conversely if you do have that it's a massive advantage massive advantage for me still to this day of the different cities that i've been in by far, Manchester's the best place I've been. By, by far, for cold approach. By far. Because the, the, the footfall of traffic is so high. The girls generally, they're generally hot, to be honest. They're a lot hotter than most places in the north. They're generally quite cool as well. And you've got all the variety of different nationalities there. I met Russians, I met Colombians, I met half a dozen girls from Africa, I met girls from Portugal. It was great. Manchester was great. Um, and the best thing though is the layout of the city. It is a pure cold approach heaven, man, in terms of layout. Um, where I am, that doesn't exist. So it's much more, it's much more been like, you know, right, I've got to go to a supermarket to do a session, which is what I did, I think, about two Fridays ago. Did a full on session in the supermarket, which uh, definitely was, a new experience it's not actually that hard but it's just like it's just getting over that mental block which is a significant one um, actually beyond that just um, I realized I realized that I went back like the week after and I did a few and I was just like do I actually want to be doing this now I've proven to myself I, I can do it do I want to do this and the answer is fuck no no I don't I don't want to be going around approaching the supermarket at night I just don't want to do it uh, which is uh, the fact that I've done it and I've done a session I've got like five six numbers and Instagrams live good ones as well that's good enough for me like I've proven to myself I can more than do it fine let's move on um, so I've decided actually next month I'm gonna get back to my natural habitat my natural habitat which is dance salsa um, I found a place in the city like a little school so there should be some good connections in there hopefully find some like nights as well um, that's my natural habitat, man. That's where I feel at my best. Um, I've been doing cold approach as a discipline, and it's massively developed me, which is why I'm doing these videos now. You know, just to be able to do this, to talk in public so obnoxiously, is something I wouldn't have previously been able to do. Uh, and a, la a large 
the kind of cold approach and videos, they're going hand in hand. So I'm really happy with that. Um, but for me, like, to get back to my nature, my perfect pull, my perfect pull, my favorite ever pulls are when I literally barely talk to the girl. To extend the hand, take her to the dance floor. And if I like her, I just spend the whole night with her on the dance floor, barely talk. There we go. For me, that's so pure. It's so pure, it's so instinctive. That's, that's where I want to be, basically. I have enough time in my work up in the head. Um, so yeah, so that's what I'm going to be doing next week, is returning into that. I'm looking forward to that. Um, and, uh, well, we'll see how that goes. I, I might do a few videos from, from the dance place as well. Um, almost didn't feel this year like I had have, I have the luxury to go and do dance and stuff because I felt I needed to get a bit more proficiency in the cold approach first. And I, I've, I've got that now. Like, I don't know how good I am, to be honest. I still have limitations all over the shop, but I can, like, I, I got an Olympian's number in the supermarket two weeks ago. It's good, it's good enough, you know. Um, so, uh, yeah, those are the two comments, really. Understanding the limits of this city, and understanding actually to, to move forward now in the in the coming months, um, I'm gonna have to actually get involved in stuff. I can't just be wandering the streets, you know, <laughs> wandering the supermarkets. So I'm gonna go uh, make some friends down at the salsa place, you know, make some acquaintances. See if I can find a second bar as well, something other than a than a coffee shop. I really like this coffee shop. Let's see if I can find like a second bar to hang out at. Um, yeah. That's essentially the, the route forward, basically. So, review of the week, and the review of the month. Um, good month, but going forward, I need uh, some access into some kind of a, you know, dance vibe, and then also um, understand the limitations of the city and, and work with that instead of trying to be freaking Hercules, going up like, you know, going up Mount Olympus every, every night in the supermarket. Um, so yeah, I'll leave things there. Just keep it short and sharp this evening.